Good afternoon, everyone. Meteorologist Mike Haddad here in the Stormwatch 9 Weather Center with an update on the severe weather impacting parts of the state right now, mainly in southern New Hampshire. So take a look at the Queen City all the way through Raymond, Derry, over to Kingston, and right along the immediate coastline. Severe thunderstorm warning in effect until 415. So we have another 45 minutes to go for not only very heavy rain and frequent lightning, but a potential for damaging winds and or some large hail. So we'll zoom in on Dr. The radar right now and show you. Look at all the intense rain falling in parts of the Merrimack Valley and in and around Merrimack all the way up through parts of Manchester. I'd say parts because southern parts of the Queen City seeing torrential rain and the lightning while farther to the north near the Hooksit border. Just a little bit of light rain, but you are certainly hearing the rumbles of thunder and seeing the lightning off to your south and it's moving right up in your direction in the next few minutes. So seek shelter in and around Hooksit, Auburn, back through Chester where the downpours are. Of course, hopefully indoors, away from windows, and preferably in the lowest floor of your home. You'll notice that band of torrential rain in constant or near constant lightning extends all the way down to Southampton, right up through Seabrook, approaching Hampton, Northampton, Rye, Portsmouth, and Newington. All spots there ready to see the intense rain, lightning, and a potential for damaging winds. Farther to the north, a lone downpour with some lightning and a chance of some hail in and around. Pittsfield and then a few more scattered back in a line all the way down through the Monadnock region right around Hinsdale as we have a borderline marginal situation there for strong storms with gusty winds and very heavy rain along with a chance of some hail. A couple more popping up in the upper valley right around Charlestown. So we're going to see this action played out right through the mid to late part of the evening. So certainly seek shelter as storms come on through and stay tuned to updates between now and and four o'clock on your mobile app or on our website, WMUR.com. Coming up at four, we're going to have a look not only at what's currently going on for the warnings and Doppler radar, but we'll take a look at future casts, let you know where those storms are headed through the course of the evening and talk much more about a storm threat that does linger into and through the weekend. Again, that's coming up at four.